Yo, 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 what's up? My name is Petrowski, and today we have a Chinese sort of Lunar New Year event, uh, catch event to actually cover, which is really cool. They're doing a catch event themed around the actual holiday event going on in-game. I think that's really cool and really cute, and the prize is super solid, so I definitely recommend sticking around to see what the prize is. Let's go ahead and get into the details of the event. It's going to be taking place on Monday, the 7th of February, 2022. The event is going to last until the 10th, so it's kind of slightly past halfway in, like 75% into the event is when the catch event will be taking place at 1300 UTC, 8 a.m. Eastern, which is my time zone, 10 a.m. BRT, or 2100 CET. And it's going to be at Route 16 in Unova on Channel 5, which is kind of funny. Uh, I wonder if that's the home channel for that sort of region. I'm not, I'm not I'm not. sure. That's pretty cool. It's pretty interesting. So Route 16, Unova, Channel 5. You don't have to be on Channel 5, but it's kind of where everyone will kind of meet for the event. You're going to have one hour to catch as many Lipard as possible. It is a Lipard catching event, so you're only going to be allowed to catch Lipard, and then you're going to have 10 minutes after that event is up to be able to submit your Pokemon to a moderator. But there are going to be two nature bonuses, plus five for Lax and plus three for Hardy. The scoring is going to be, you know, total sum of IVs, plus nature bonus, plus score. So there's no species bonus, which is nice. Uh, it's just the total IVs plus if you got a nature add that nature bonus now on to the basic rules for every catch event first through third place are sorted from highest to lowest scores and fourth place is the lowest score and you can always submit one entry what that all of that means is that you need to kind of understand which you have a better chance of winning if you submit your lowest score pokemon that you caught or your highest score and that sort of goes based on what's the average score you need to win a catch event which ends up being around 160 plus points for first through third and around 25 to 20 or below for fourth place uh, all Pokemon must must be caught within the event time at the event location, so you can't go catch any, you know, you can't go catch Lipard now and try to submit those. They've got to be caught during that one hour. All Pokemon must remain unchanged, untrained, and unevolved. I always recommend to leave your Pokemon in the PC and label them until after the event is over. That's a great way to not make that mistake. You must be the OT of the Pokemon, so you can't trade, you can't catch a Lipard and trade it to an alt account or to a friend <clears throat> to try to have them win the tournament. If you're the one who caught the Pokemon, you have to be the one to also submit it. You must link your entry to any participating staff member to submit it. The two, the three staff members for this event are going to be Miki, uh, Seth, and Cosmuth. So thank you to them for hosting. In the event of a tie, the winner will be determined by earliest catch time, which is pretty relevant. And players can only enter the event with one account slash character. I believe you can participate on multiple characters, but you can't submit on multiple characters which is pretty important now onto the prizes first place prize is a really cool one i love this pokemon and i love this shiny i didn't love all i didn't appreciate aldino for a long time but nowadays i really do first place prize is going to be a shiny gift aldino your choice of nature two moves and three selectable ivs probably make it 31 hp 31 defense 31 special defense probably your best bet it's a pretty tanky wally pokemon plus three times 28 in the other ivs plus 1000 rp which is super sick and rp is actually super super bad valuable right now so winning a catch event during the holiday event could be even more beneficial second place is going to get 500 reward points and then third and fourth place will both get 250 reward points respectively hope you guys are excited for this catch event i hope you found this video helpful if you did hit the like button and that'll let me know and subscribe for future pokemon content check out all the playlist links below uh check out the discord link below to join an incredible community and consider becoming a youtube member to me for five bucks a month if you want to go above and beyond and support me it means a ton thank you all so much and hopefully i'll see you at the event